Katie and I are here today to show you how to make a la salsa di pomodoro per la pizza. In other words, a tomato pizza sauce. As you know, I need a translator because obviously being <laughs> Italian, it is a problem, okay? Now, also you need some salt, need some excellent oregano. Yep, and oh. some extra virgin olive oil and some pepper. Yes, amazing. And shall I open this for you? You open it, otherwise it ruins my fingernails. Poverina, what a shame. <laughs> There we go. I'll open it for you, darling. Thanks Are you ready with, with the machine? Yep. Because that's, uh, that's so a big we job always we've got. use an Italian brand of tomatoes, and I'm just going to whiz them up so it's nice and smooth when it goes on the pizza. <laughs> when it goes on top of the pizza, you want them to be really, really smooth. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Fantastic. Job done. Job done. Uh, you add some a nice pinch of salt. Did yep. you say before? What, what was About why? a teaspoon of salt, and it should be generous teaspoon of salt because you want this pizza topping to have a really, really good flavour to it. Oregano from our garden. <laughs> dried Perfecto. oregano. It's about one of the only herbs that the Italians use in its dried form, and it should be a good quality oregano. Oregano, Perfect. oregano, same thing. Oregano. 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 <laughs> okay. Va benissimo. Yeah. Adesso pepe. Basta, basta. So that's good quantity of black pepper. E olio d'oliva. Yes. Olive oil. Perfetto. And then we're just going to stir it up. Did you know when the first tomato came into Italy? No, I didn't actually. Well, spookily enough, it was Halloween. It was the 31st of October, 1548. <laughs> and guess where it came into? Naples, Napoli. No, it was first written about in a court of the Medici in Tuscany, your region. Oh. No tomatoes in Italy previous to 1548. So no pizza? No pizza before then. Guys, no, no pizza, no tomato. <laughs> So well, we taste so, this one. Taste the sauce. Mmm. I like that. It should be really nice in its own right, even before it goes on top of the pizza. I think that's what's important in cooking, that you need to taste what you're making all the time. That it's a must, okay? Definitely. Capito? Bravo. <laughs> that's bellissimo. Grazie. Prego. Ciao, ciao. <laughs>